Hi there, I'm Janelle Fletcher, a speaker and a confidence coach. I live in New Zealand and I just want to share some uh, things that I've learned in my own life. And one is this, I have a symbol today of a mirror. And for too many years I looked at the mirror in the wrong way and I'm just wondering what mirror you look into. And when I take a look at this one, it's got a magnifying glass or a magnifying side of it. And I wonder that when you look into the mirror each day, whether you look into that and go and you see the bigness of everything. You see every scar, every blemish, every, every whatever you don't like. The truth of that is not who you are. The truth of what you see there and its magnification of all those blemishes and scars is not true. For some of you, you look at the other side of the mirror and it's where it's all small. You know, and that's when you're feeling insignificant or not good enough or invisible or not even noticed. And for so many years I experienced that, I felt really insignificant, really small. It's no wonder I played out lots of eating issues and, and anorexia at those times of my life. So uh, sometimes we're looking at the big side, sometimes we're looking at the really insignificant side of the mirror. Um, other times I believe that sometimes we look at, at our mirror as though it's broken. You know, it's a bit like one of those fables where the, where the step, a wicked stepmother or whoever um, helps shatter the glass. Uh, that's a funny sort of story that I'm uh, retelling. But uh, that's how we often see our life. We look at ourselves and we look, our lives are broken or we are broken. That again is not the truth of who we are. Sometimes I believe we look at other people's mirror. You know, I was at a talk recently and I got people to look in their own mirror. And then I got them to look at their neighbor's mirror. And so often we're looking into their mirror and going, you're more beautiful than I am. You're more attractive than I am. You have these qualities that I don't have. We look into the comparison mirror, which again is not helpful because it's not, it's not allowing us to be who we really are and to, to see the beauty of who we are. You know, I have this quote that I made up once and it was about this. Your greatest success is frolicking in the sea of difference, not floating in the sea of sameness. You know, how silly is it, how stupid is it that we try and be like someone else and feel special that way? Our specialness or our uniqueness comes from just being who we are. You know, I think in life too, we get told the ABCs of how to live life or how to be beautiful or how to look a certain way or how to feel good a certain way. Instead of ABC, I encourage people to look at XYZ in your own way, starting with X, your own X factor, what makes up you and what makes up you and your beauty, what makes up you and your, and your body the way you are, not how someone else is. I also encourage you to look at a mirror with depth. You know, so often this is very superficial at what we're looking at. We're looking only at the external and not the beauty and the richness of what's inside. I invite you to, to see yourself and to see your body as magnificent, not deficient. To see yourself as significant and not insignificant. You know, the way that I helped myself through, through years of not liking my body, now loving it, was to also get a different perspective. So often we just look at this perspective or we get someone else's opinion and get their perspective. The only thing that gets me through my days now and the, and the great thing that gets me through my days now is instead of looking at self-perspective, I look at what I call source perspective. That is my own divinity. For some of you that might mean God, it might be spirit, it might be nature, it might be universe, it might be just your greater self. But I invite you to not just look at it as yourself from a self perspective, which is sometimes a superficial or not even real perspective, but to look at source perspective about how amazing you are. Go well. If you want to check me out, www.janellefletcher.com or lovemybodylovememe.org. Be bold, be beautiful and be enough.